wanted to die of breast cancer, uh, getting a mammogram is the best way to ensure that you don't. But what happens when your body is put together in a way that a mammogram simply isn't enough? So if you are born with a dense breast tissue or if you are a woman who has dense breast tissue, then you will have dense breast tissue for the majority of your life. Every day, Dr. Sean Conwell uses his eyes, his experience, and his knowledge to help make life-saving decisions for patients. Thanks to a new tool, the automated whole breast ultrasound, dense breast tissue has become less of an obstacle in diagnosing breast cancer. What this poster illustrates is the difference between fatty breasts and dense breasts. So with fatty breasts, if a tumor shows up, like this little white tumor right here, it shows up like the moon on a night sky. You can see it just fine. If, however, you take this little white tumor and put it over here in a woman who has dense breasts, you can see that it becomes invisible like a polar bear in a snowstorm. You can't see it. If you want to compare a mammogram to an ultrasound, a mammogram is a comic strip. The new ultrasound technology is a movie. This is the ultrasound of a patient with breast cancer. And that shadow is cancer. Yes. If you look at the same patient's mammogram, this is it. She has dense breasts and you can't see that. And I can't see it either. So this mammogram would be read as negative. There are 21 states nationwide that require physicians to notify their patients that they have dense breast tissue. South Carolina is not one of those states, but Palmetto Health has made the decision now that they have this new technology to let patients know. The way to, to have women survive breast cancer is to find it early. After seeing this technology, I wanted to know if I am like half of the women in the world who have dense breast tissue. So I experienced the technology firsthand. The technologist is maintaining contact, but the robotic arm is moving the probe. These are your breasts on a mammogram, and they are dense. I let my eyes kind of focus through the image, and what I'm looking for is that natural, that little pop of something different. Of course, you had absolutely nothing. You had totally normal breasts. The whole breast ultrasound was paid for through funds raised in Walk for Life, which is ironic because this new tool is giving many women a chance at life they may not have had before. There is only one way to know, and that is to get a mammogram.